Hey everybody, Tyler here with Build Ready uh, down here in Florida. And I wanted to show you, I showed you a video of uh, kind of a, a foundation getting ready uh, for the monolithic pour on one of our projects. And I wanted to show you a project that's in the stage of uh, block. And um, once again, as many of you know, I'm from originally up north. Cameron is still up north. He's gonna be moving down into Florida um, later this summer but uh, anyways when I first got down into Florida I, I didn't know anything about construction really down here and this was all so foreign and new to me so I figured I'd share it with everybody um, so hopefully you'll find it interesting instead of framed walls down here uh, we have block uh, CMU walls down in Florida and that's because of the hurricanes the weather and termites um, and quite honestly it's actually a great way of building um, so uh, basically what they do is they come in uh, we have a monolithic slab uh, here and they'll have uh, about every four feet on center uh, you know up to five feet on center we'll have these uh, columns uh, that will go up and they're solid filled columns so not all of this gets poured solid in concrete it's actually just these columns up into the lintel which is um, right here at the top uh, all the way around so all that kind of gets poured so if you can imagine there's solid columns that go down each uh, four feet uh, on center or so and then that top and it all kind of just locks it in um, so anyways here's the traditional CMU block that we use um, and uh, like I said they're just they're they're just hollow uh, CMU and then uh, coming up the side here this uh, as you can see has an inspection port so when they pour uh, concrete uh, from up above, uh, that ties into the rebar. It goes up uh, all the way to the lintel. So there's a piece. There's a piece of rebar that comes down all the way down here. They pour that solid in concrete, and it kind of ties it together. And you'll kind of see all the way around. Here's those inspection ports, and those inspection ports are just to ensure that the concrete actually comes out and completely fills that cell uh, there. So. Anyways, I'll continue to do some videos on this. Um, and uh, anyways, I hope you guys find this this interesting. Um, it, it's all brand new or was brand new to me. And I, I didn't really have anybody to show me this stuff. So uh, this stuff would have been really helpful for me. So hopefully this video will help someone. Appreciate you guys watching. Please subscribe, comment. If you have any questions, reach out to us. Thanks.